oh man, it's it's a video game, and I happen to know the guy who made the video game. So I'm like, why not play the video game? Why not, why not, why not give it a go? What's my player data? Oh, it's me. C could you not steal my name? We're a ferret! That's always fantastic. The Tower of Destiny, you know what? I'm feeling like a little destiny myself. Attack! <laughs> no! Locked. I need a key to use this object. Oh. Oh. Well, that's, <laughs> that's actually pretty neat. I need a key. Ooh. Ah, cardio. Okay, gotta be a little more careful than that. But I still need a key. Hey, you bingoids. You wanna, wanna, wanna come on? Okay, I can only get one bingoid at a time. You bingus. What does this ferret have against these boys? I don't know. Don't ask too many questions. Why does Doom guy hate demons? What, if it, what has a demon ever done to you? Do you have names or anything? Oh! Oh, they do. That, oh, it's at the top. <laughs> Second Zelda! Awa Link's Awakening. You do that very much time. What? On the way out? On the way out, I see. Hold on, I don't wanna. So. I think that's how far I need him to be for this to work, work. I'm, I'm, out, of, I'm out of juice. So, how smart is he anyway? He, 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 oh, <laughs> it's a little. It's a little dance. Oh, cool. My observations. We'll move towards Leaf. We'll attack Leaf when it moves into his tile. It can be killed by bumping. But first, move on the same axis it's already facing. Okay, so it, it will. It's it's like a like a drawed snake to an extent, like a serpent. Not not quite. The drawed serpent has some has some oddities to it. Ooh, that's probably move order stuff. Ah, oh oh, that's a lot of information. It's a prime key. I do anything with you. Can I even escape him once he's on my tail? I don't think I can. I always need to keep that distance, I guess. Hmm. How do I build distance with you, then? See, what I kind of want, what I really want, is that he's on that other side of the block, so I can stretch him that way. But he will always prefer to move on his, on his existent axis, so he'll never never go around corners the way I need him to. Helps a little bit. Oh no, but that... Oh, no, that doesn't work. Ah, because he's already moving down. How do I flip this around, though? Shake him. What is the plan? Well, the plan is so obvious. Ish. I need him X spaces away from me. This doesn't help. I got him. I got him. What I think I want to do is I want to wait here, and then I want to... Yeah, now we got him. And I... Oh. Got him. I'm just a little ferret. 
I got one prime key for a prime door. Why is that a Minecraft? Brawl. Going down is just never really an option. Unless I want to wait. I mean, by the time that's done. I do want to point out that the sound's a bit loud. We'll, we'll turn it down a little bit. The problem is I lose distance. I can't drop... The, what is this for? What does this platform get me? Because I... They don't fall, right? What's it called again? Monster Gate. It, I'll be honest, it's kind of weird that the brick walls are like flat and there's like pits, but the walls are flat. I can wait as long as I like that. and I can't recover him from there. There is something here I gotta do. Nice! Oh, I can't stop once I'm going. Because I can only recover him all the way down here. What's this, bridge? Wooden floor. Stupid, and I move. Why do you keep doing that, Sammy? Why are you so dumb? <coughs> oh my god, do I have the same fucking problem again? But that's how I lure him out. Stuff never happens. That is an interesting thing that draw sword mechanic does kind of solve for you. You can just stop monsters with your big old, really big sword. Hmm. We need one more key, and it's already getting pretty spicy. At least it ain't holding hold, hold any punches. Bridge over nothing. This is just a wooden floor. In, in draw, you had bridges, and, and when they were no longer connected, and you usually use trapdoors for that, they would fall at once. Skirt corners like that. That's pretty neat. Alright, what's what's the deal this time? Collapsing road. the door snapshot though that's pretty cute what a, 
called anyway. Oh, they're just called Monster Gates. Still. Huh. Um. We'll make this. Oh, I know. I know what I'm supposed to do. I know what I'm supposed to do. We need a buddy. Yeah, that won't work. So he'll catch me. And he'll move upwards because that's what he likes to do. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so I know that because in Drawed, it's not uncommon for yellow doors. Not blue doors, because I think blue doors only open when you leave the when you leave the current room. But the yellow doors, they open when all the monsters are dead or something. No, not yellow doors, green doors. Green doors are for monsters. And it's not uncommon that sometimes you have to keep something alive or something stays alive. So I already kinda knew what to expect from that puzzle. Around the bend. But I need to know what to, how to how to bend this bend. Yeah, you clearly want me to do this first. But then you'll get stuck, right? So no, you work better if I go around this way, because then you get stuck over here and I can do this. Okay, so I need to go over here. What are you for? You are for something. But what advantage do you... Oh! Okay, okay. No, 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 no. How do I do that? See, I kind of figured out what it wants. Wait, with that extra block, is it possible? Yeah, he's just stuck, right? Why'd you, why'd you break that one? This, this won't work. I know it won't, because I'm, I'm very smart. Thank you. How does this help? This helps with one thing only, and that's getting this guy out. He's not affected. He can be killed anyway. This guy can be killed pretty easily no matter what I do. So they're irrelevant. They're not part of the puzzle. They're just little goofy goobers who do something else to the interact with the puzzle in some fashion. What I need with you... Oh, what's the move order? Um, I need him to get stuck over here, and then go back down here. Because if he goes back down there... Oh, it actually says what's under the wall! Pretty cool. When he goes up, I need him to go down. Because I can recover him from there by going up here. Right? You get what I'm going for? But how do I break that wall without you popping off? Right? See, the problem is, I can't go back. And if I stop, that guy on the right gets all funny about it. Does this in any way help? I imagine not. Like, monster order aside. Obviously, this is the intended route, right? But, like, it's not like I can lure him anywhere when I'm down here, because this is entirely outside of his field. That just gets him stuck in that case. What does this mean anyway? Just that it's not being cleared? Kind of. The point is that I have to break this wall in order to get this guy through, right? That's that's the trick. Is that because I have to break this wall, you need to be somehow in, in disposed, or I can only break this on the way down. But if I break this on the way down, that implicitly means I'm breaking this on the way up. 
And like that doesn't work. And this requires that I get this guy out. Obviously for that guy, because that's really all it does. Or, I guess theoretically, if I somehow get him stuck here and he never goes down, which he will. Did I get something new? No. Flying snakes, such a weird idea, given how snakes move. I think I'm going to give this a little more time. 